Hey guys, we're back on the NRA show floor and I ran over to Fax and because I heard they've got new Glock barrels coming out. So they're gonna be offering threaded 34, threaded 17, and threaded 19 barrels. Correct. Um, and possibly, maybe unthreaded barrels as well? Yeah, we have unthreaded as oh, well. Oh, very cool, very cool. Um, and you've got a bunch of different colors. Yep. I only have a couple here. Yep. But um, We've got the chameleon, the okay. uh, tin coated, and the oil rub bronze. Those are the three very colors cool. we'll be bringing out first. Very cool. They, they look uh, pretty darn nice, actually. Well, thank you. They're, they're the same type of barrel quality we've been putting in all of our AR barrels for years now. Nice. So as far as the quality control and the accuracy, they're regular grooved conventional barrel. Oh, good. And uh, they sit on the polygonal rifling with them. The flame flute, as you can see on the outside, yeah, is one of our nice. patented features that we've been selling on our air barrels for quite a while. And that really helps break up and, and bring some light to the barrel. So that's kind of one of the features that we like about the uh, block barrels that we're making now. No, they have very, very handsome uh, fluting on that. I like that a lot. Um, even the markings on the hood, very that's cool. Our, that's our X logo. Yeah, so I like that. I like that. There. Yeah, I, I dig that quite space. a lot. Uh, so what's MSRP on these guys? These barrels range from one. 49 to 229, I believe. Okay, it's not terrible, not terrible. Yeah. Uh, pretty in line with the rest of the market, mm -hmm. which is good. Uh, yeah, I'm excited to see how these pan out. Well, these are our first venture in the pistol barrels. We'll be adding more as time comes. Oh, cool. But the uh, rifle barrels have been very successful. We appreciate all the customers that have been buying and the feedback. So the same quality we've been learning on the barrels for the rifles, we're going to be using the pistol barrels. Oh, awesome. So yeah. the Glock's our first choice. I, and I heard a rumor of uh, a couple of other pistol models coming out. I'm not going to spoil it for more the guys. To, more to come. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I think there's, there's one in particular that I'm really excited about, and I think that you guys might be the first ones doing a barrel in that pitch for that gun. That's possible, yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> See, he didn't nice. think I was uh, as well informed as I am. <laughs> I know you've been talking to Nathan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Nathan's uh, good people. We also have a new pencil barrel, 10 and a half inch uh, yes. AR barrel. And okay. this comes in at under a pound? Under a pound, one and eight wow. twist. That's cool. That's I dig your, that. Yep, that's your QPQ nitrate steel barrel. One and eight twist, under a pound. Oh, wow. A lot like of the that. people are looking for variations in the rifle barrels, and I think one of the things about our products, with our team of people, we have a lot of industry knowledge. Not so much myself, but our group. Right. And what they do is they try to keep track of what the shooter's looking for, because in our line, our, our, our whole goal is high quality, high value. That makes sense. And we're looking for that experience. So the shooters are looking for suppressed, short barrel, lightweight, three gun. There's reasons they're buying our barrels, or, or barrels. And what we're trying to do is design the product to meet the need. I mean, we're supposed to facilitate a positive experience for them when they buy a product and they're using. So that's where the short, lightweight, the muzz lock, the pin and weld at 14 and a half that becomes legal, that's small enough diameter side the gas block over. All those features, all the barrels, the Glock barrels, the flame flute, the different colors are all meant so that our customers have a, a really positive experience using our products and firearms. No, I'm impressed by this. I'm impressed by the Glock barrels. I've got one of your guys' gunner barrels. I like that thing a lot. A very cool profile on that. Well, um, and actually, I think I shot the lightweight, uh, you know, the the lightweight pencil barrel pencil muzzle brake gun. Yeah. At shot, and that thing was just it's just crazy, isn't it? awesome. Yeah. Like I did, I was blown away that a gun so light would recoil so little. Well, we put the low mass bolt carrier, the 14 and a half inch pencil with the, with the pin and welded muzzle brake, mm -hmm. three stage muzzle brake. We used the carbon fiber hand guard and that gun came in at 4.93 pounds. Oh, wow. That's without a, a magazine or not. That's awesome. Yeah, it was under five pounds. And, and you know, the thing is, all the products were individually designed to be good at what they do, whether it be a bolt carrier, whether it be a muzzle brake, whether it be a barrel. All those components, carbon fiber, the, the attachment mechanisms, are all designed so that each one of the pieces is good. And because we don't actually make complete rifles, we said, hey, let's pull these together and shoot them and let's see how this system functions, right? Yeah. And that was where we had the most excitement because they all came together well and all the, all the individual products performed well together. Yeah, yeah, no, it really did. I really enjoyed that rifle a lot. But uh, they can find you online at yes. uh, faxon.com. Faxonfirearms.com. Oh, we, we have everything see? online. We've got 800 dealers around the country, so look for yep. them as well. Yep. But yeah, yep. and, and there'll um, be more new stuff all the time. Yeah, and if you guys aren't entirely familiar with Faxon, they do do a lot of uh, private label stuff too. So yes. you, there is a chance that you have a Faxon barrel right now. There's a good chance. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you.